Good evening, everyone. I'm Riley King, and welcome to my evening news report right here on the Riley King Network. Let's begin. Take a look at this photo here. A new development coming to Manchester. Groundbreaking held for new hotel in Manchester Mill Yard. True Hotel set to open next year. Manchester's historic Mill Yard is starting to look a little different with developers breaking ground on a new hotel. The new project will sit at the corner of Commercial and Spring Streets. Florida based developer Peter Florence's company has owned the empty lot for more than a year. We're building a 125 room true hotel, Lots said. It's a new brand by Hilton. The true brand is geared toward millennials, Lips said. He said that one of the reasons for picking the location is the nearby campuses of Southern New Hampshire University and the University of New Hampshire. The hotel is not the only plan in the work. Under the hotel on the commercial street side, we're building retail space that will bring new restaurants into the mill yard, Flips said. We're also adding some parking, so there will be about three times the parking here when you're done, as there is today. Mayor Joyce Craig and City Alderman were on hand Tuesday for a groundbreaking ceremony. The mayor called it a historic day. It really is, she said. We've got development going on in the mill yard. It's not often that we see something going on. Observantly, we've got these wonderful mills, but now we have a new hotel going in. The True Hotel is one of new hotels coming to the Queen City. The other will be located on Lake Avenue, officials with AAM 15 Management, which is in charge of that project, said the hotel will be a 123-room, four-story residence in by Marriott with open-air parking on site. It's expected to be open by May 20. It's just an indication of the value they see in Manchester, Craig said. The True Hotel is slated to open in June 2020. And that does it for my evening news report right here on the Riley King Network. I hope you all have a great evening, and I'll see you back here tomorrow for another news report. Good night, everyone. Bye.